Hello everybody. I learned something new in Photoshop this week and I want to share with you how to do it. In this tutorial we are going to learn how to make a hologram like this. And for this instance we're going to do Chancellor Palpatine. <clears throat> so in order to do this make four copies of it. We'll hide this one and we're going to need another layer up here and we're going to solid color right there. And just hit OK. Alright, now top layer, make a new layer. And on this layer you're going to shift and backspace 50% gray. Alright, got that going on. Now we want to go to filter filter gallery halftone I'm already here the size of these lines that you're going to use is adjustable um, I guess a larger document you can use the larger size um, for contrast I'm going to leave it around 17 um, what was it going to uh, I don't like the way that'll fit on this document, so we'll stay there. Hit OK. Now, <clears throat> go to your channels right there. And hitting Control, pressing Control and hitting the RGB. We'll open up that panel, and there we go. So we're going to hide this. And then what we're going to do is... Select that copy, that layer, <clears throat> and then we're going to mask it. And then we're going to go up to the mask, make sure you're on the mask, hit Alt, and just drag it down, and then drag it down again. All right, we have our lines now. What we're going to do now is select the bottom layer here. Go to filter, blur, motion blur. This one I want to. Okay. Put up to there. Filter, blur, motion blur. This one we're going to cut in half, or roughly. All right, there we go. <clears throat> now that these are all set. We're going to have to use this guy. Bring him up here. Make this visible. Deselect that, deselect that, deselect that, and deselect this. Now this <clears throat> we're going to use for the displacement map. So in order to do this, you're supposed to make it black and white from the tutorial I followed. I'm okay with it right here because of the detail. So we are going to save this to our desktop. As a PSD and per Palpatine, cool. So we save that there. Now we uncheck that. We'll click this back on. Click these back visible. Okay. Now selecting the top copy and this this uh, the lines right here. We're gonna go to filter, distort, displace. Now, depending on your image, it, these the displacement map will actually go with the grooves and in, in the contours of all the uh, of the image. So um, let's get. I think we'll stay at two for this document. Hit OK. It's going to ask you for the PSD, and it's right there. Boom. So you actually, I actually did notice a little change to it. So now that we have that all said and done, all right, let's just group this. Group from layers. Group one. Now with this, let's put a hue saturation on this group. Where we are. There we go. We're going to colorize this. And then we're going to... There we go. Pretty cool, huh?
Hmm. All right, so let's see if we can make this a little brighter and bring out some more color to it. Now, from the tutorial I followed, this is to the T. Um, I think I expanded on his tutorial, so we're going to put this bit guy back on. And then we are going to, let's do this, filter, we'll blur the top one, motion blur. And let's lower this considerably. Just slightly. There we go. Now we're going to bring this up. Doesn't look like a hologram yet. All right, so we're going to go to the blend mode. We're going to go to screen. Now it's looking more like a hologram. And then we are going to lower the opacity a tad. And outer and add an outer glow. Mm -hmm. A little adjust to the opacity. And there you go. Hope you all enjoyed. Cheers.